Welding is a critical process in various industries, from construction to aerospace. Ensuring the quality and integrity of welds is of utmost importance, as any defects can compromise the structural strength or safety of the final product. This is where non-destructive testing, NDT, comes in. Unlike destructive testing, which involves damaging the weld to assess its quality, NDT methods allow for thorough inspection without affecting the weld's integrity. Let's now dive into the top 5 NDT methods used in welding. Visual inspection is the most basic yet crucial NDT method. It involves a thorough visual examination of the weld, looking for any visible defects such as cracks, porosity, or incomplete fusion. While it may seem simple, visual inspection requires trained eyes and attention to detail. It's often the first step in the NDT process and can quickly identify major issues that need further investigation. Magnetic particle testing, MPT, is particularly effective in detecting surface and near-surface defects. Magnetic particle testing, MPT, is particularly effective in detecting surface and near-surface defects. The process involves magnetizing the weld area and applying iron particles. If there's a flaw, the magnetic field is disrupted, causing the particles to gather at the defect's location. This makes the flaw easily visible under proper lighting conditions. MPT is commonly used for ferromagnetic materials and is highly sensitive to even small defects. Liquid penetrant testing, LPT, is another widely used NDT method, especially for surface cracks. The process involves applying a liquid penetrant, which seeps into any surface openings. After a certain time, the excess penetrant is removed, and a developer is applied. The developer draws out the penetrant, making any cracks or discontinuities clearly visible. LPT is relatively simple and cost-effective, making it a popular choice for many applications. Ultrasonic testing, UT, is a versatile NDT method that can assess both surface and internal defects. Ultrasonic testing, UT, is a versatile NDT method that can assess both surface and internal defects. It works on the principle of sound waves, with a transducer sending high-frequency waves into the weld. If there's a flaw, the waves are reflected back, and the transducer picks up the signals. By analyzing the time taken for the waves to return and their intensity, the inspector can determine the size, location, and nature of the defect. UT is highly accurate and widely used in various industries. Radiographic testing, RT, involves the use of X-rays or gamma rays to inspect welds. The radiation passes through the weld, and a film or digital detector captures the resulting image. This image, known as a radiograph, shows the internal structure of the weld, including any defects. RT provides a comprehensive view and is particularly effective in detecting volumetric flaws such as voids or inclusions. However, it requires specialized equipment and trained personnel to ensure safety. Non-destructive testing, NDT, methods play a vital role in welding quality control. By employing these techniques, inspectors can identify and assess defects without compromising the weld's integrity. Each NDT method has its strengths and limitations, and often a combination of methods is used for a thorough inspection. As technology advances, so do NDT techniques, with innovations like automated systems and digital imaging enhancing efficiency and accuracy. In the ever-evolving field of welding, NDT remains a cornerstone, ensuring the highest standards of quality and safety.